So we got to talk about Kenneth Walker performance Monday night versus the Eagles. And in my opinion, I think this was his best performance as a Seattle Seahawks as far as running the ball with just straight determination, his vision, and just using every aspect of his skill set and why he was drafted to do this and be the main back. Look at him right now. Look at his vision, though. Look at this right now. Look how he just understand the blocking scheme, and he understand number 87 right here, you know what I'm saying, with the seal block. And look how he's – look at his quick foot – his footwork, right? Look how he just uh, – that little jump step. And this was the beautiful, beautiful move right here. He got one guy to beat, this guy right here, in space. And look at Kenneth Walker use his athletic ability and agility right there. That was – that right there was perfect right there. As he just faked like he's going inside, uh, that little step right there, and then use his vision and speed and follow the convoy all the way down for a big-time touchdown against the Eagles, man. This was an absolutely Kenneth Walker. This is why they got K-9 right here, dog. First of all, the play was, to the, uh, was supposed to go to the left, right? And look how he just cut back, cut back, uh, more cut back. And then that one move right there, and the rest is just athletic ability. Ball on the outside, boom, got in the end zone, man. Like, I've always been a great fan of Kenneth Walker, and I'm telling you, that Monday night game was his absolute best game I've seen him um, play as a Seahawks. You see that? Look at that right there. That's another ability right there. It's just God-given. He's low center of gravity, and the way uh, how hard he was running, man. Like, this play right here, man, is just just little shit like this once again. And he sees number 21 right there. And ah, that little one-two step right there. And then boom. And then just shrug him off, right? Shrug him off. Look at his low center of gravity. This is what I'm talking about. Look how low he is to the ground. And then boom, the ability to see. Look, right now his eyes is looking at the ground. But for somehow reason, he could just feel Feel the way he's at as far as his football presence, right? And then, ah, uh, and then he cut it back to the outside and now use that speed. Use speed and use that ability. That's, hey, Kenneth Walker was so impressive Monday night, bro. He was so impressive, man. I was looking back. I'm like, this is his best game as a Seahawks, man. Just the ability, once again, squeezing through the hole. One thing about Kenneth Walker, um, K-9, that used to piss me off, honestly, was he always used to look to just bounce everything outside. That was his thing right there. Just bounce everything outside. But on Monday night, he just knew. Look at that squeeze. Look at that beautiful blocking, man. Beautiful blocking. And look how he just got through that hole. Just, uh, got through that hole. Great block by Will Deasley. And then explode through that and just put your shoulder down. Put your shoulder down, man. K9 was on, hey, he was on something else, dog. He was running so hard, man. I thought the man was on some blue chew. You know what I'm saying? Look at this cut. Look at those little cuts right there. Those cuts right there, man. God damn. This dude cut better than your fucking local barber, dog. This dude make harder cuts than a barber. Uh, look at that. Just jump stuff. Uh, oh, that's so pretty. That right there and just be tough. That was so pretty, man. K9 was a dog out there, man. K9 was a dog Monday night, man. I'm telling you, this is the hardest I ever seen him run. Just look at how tough he was. Breaking tackles, making people miss left and right, using jump step, man. K-9 is out of this universe, bro. I ain't even going to lie to you. Look, a free linebacker coming in right there, and then he just have that vision. Then he see number 32, Blankenship, and look how he just got, this is what I'm talking about, the low center of gravity and running hard. He got low, man, straight up. You know what I'm saying? Just got low. Who was it, juvenile to the window? Y'all, I don't even know who remember that. Man, get low. Get low, get low, get low to the window, to the wall, to the sweat down my, and all this female. And right there, oh, man, did y'all see how he just effortlessly, 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 look at me, I'm getting so hyped, effortlessly got the man. He, he seemed like he made the first guy miss every time. Every time he caught the ball Monday night, the first guy missed. And once again, his low center of gravity. When people tell you about low center of gravity, this is what they mean, man. As soon as contact is about to come, he get low and get that extra yard. And get that extra yard, man. I'm telling y'all, man. Like, y'all watching this film, dog. This is, I think this is going to be K1 is about to have an explosive last few games of the season. Explosive last few games. Just get your shoulder down right there. This is what I'm talking about. This is what K9 never used to do, man. 
This is what used to get me so annoyed with him because he has all the ability, but he never used to put his foot down and just unload a pass and just get anything you can. And on Monday night, he was doing that. Boom! Got the ability to just load his shoulder. Load his shoulder and just get those grinding, dirty yards. I call that the dirty yards. And he was getting the clean yards and the um, dirty yards right there. Oh, that's beautiful. Do you see how he just explode through that hole, though? Explode. This dude, I don't know if he was on Blue Chew. I don't know if he was on some Cialis. I don't know what the fuck he was, but he was running hard, bro. He was running hard, man. I'm telling you, man. He was going through holes like a construction worker. Man, give my man a, a hard hat, man. Because he was going through holes like a construction worker right there. And the toss. And then, oh, yeah, look. Come on here, young fella. Oh, yeah. K9 was not playing, man. K9 was not playing. He's like, hey, Kelly Ringo. You know what I'm saying? Kelly Ringo. You want to make a tackle? Welcome to the NFL, shawty. Welcome to the NFL, shawty. Look at 22. Get that shoulder work. Get that shoulder work right there. Give him that shoulder right underneath the chin. Give him that shoulder underneath the chin right there, baby. That shot, boom! Oh, man, K-9 was out there looking like a dog. Playing like a dog. Talk to him, K-9. Talk to him, K-9, his best game as a Seahawks. And this is one thing I love about him, man. He has that ability. He makes beautiful hands, bro. I mean, this dude got cocoa butter hands, man. I'm talking about his hands is clean. Catches ball easily, shawty. Catches the ball easily out the backfield. Swing pass right there. Boom. And now explode. See that? Explode. Ah, uh, I'm through contact. Running through contact. Bruh, I can't wait to see what this guy's going to do the last three weeks, man. Because I have a feeling, man, this dude is about to take off and finish the season strong as shit. Like the way he did Monday night, man, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. This was K-9's best game. I don't even care about his yardage. I'm just talking about this, the way he was determined. He was in dancing like he used to do. I used to always say, this man used to be dancing around like he's in Dancing with the Stars or something. But on Monday night, man, he was no dance. There was no dance. He saw the hole, and he attacked the hole. He saw hole, and he attacked the hole. Look at that little vision right there, bro. Look at that vision right there. Look at that toughness, how he was finishing the run. How he was finishing one. Y'all got to check this shit out, bro. Y'all got to check this shit out. Look at this man's vision right there. Once again, he's already seen this is clogged up. And somehow, he saw this hole open up right here. This is unbelievable vision, bro. This is unbelievable vision, dog. I'm telling y'all. Lens crafters, give this dude a fucking deal, dog. Lens crafters, because this dude got 2020 vision, Bray B. You know what I'm saying? 1-800-VISION, dog. You know what I'm saying? Call K-9 because his vision was on point on Monday night. His vision was on point. And once again, easy hands. Easy hands. And this right here. Oh! Oop! Oop! Okie doke. And got some yards. Like, you can't teach this, bro. It's either you got this or you don't. This is one of those things. This is why you're special, K-9. This play right here show me why you special, big dog. Ah, right, coming out the backfield. Boom. Uh, uh, there you go. Now... Easy pass, easy catch. Right? Look how he set this dude up like a math equation. Look how he set him up like a math equation. Da -da! Get off me. And then, ah, number 53, okie dog, ankle breaker. Okie dog, ankle breaker. Y'all know we got to see that again. Y'all know we got to see that again, baby. Run that shit back, Turbo. Run it back. Let me show you all this shit. Look at K9, shawty. Look at K9, shawty. Swing pass. Ah, okie dog, math equation. One, two, three, go. One, two, three, go. Equation, first down. K-9 was out of this world, and in my opinion, his best game as a Seattle Seahawks, man. And we needed him the most. Y'all know who this is. I'm the G to the U to the R to the U. Y'all like this, love this, share this, and I am out.